Senator Sheffield just a few minutes ago mentioned that a principal in his day took a kid by the collar and held them into his office, and he assumes that's what's going on today. Well, that may be what's going on in his home school where he has real control over his five children and their education, uh, but that's not what happens in the real world. In the real world, we heard testimony in committee that talked about um, teachers actually ignoring situations of bullying such as hitting and kicking and shoving and pushing and, and uh, general all-around bullying when a teacher would turn his or her back on the situation and not deal with it. That's why this, another reason this bill is important, because there needs to be a message given not only to kids, but a message given to staff at every one of our schools that that kind of uh, turning your back on a, a situation of bullying is no longer acceptable, if it ever was. And so uh, I think that's a strong message of support um, for this bill. Um, uh, I don't think there's any excuse for a teacher turning his or her back on a kid uh, who is being... Um, criticized, bullied, unmercifully cruel to children, and we heard so many instances of that in committee. So um, it, the bill isn't perfect by a long shot. I don't like the dress code part of it. There are other parts of the bill that I'm not real crazy about. But on balance, this is a good bill that's going to protect children and get a message to teachers that they should be aware when this is going on and it's not going to be tolerated. So I uh, would urge your support of House Bill 1254.